सूर्याय नम ओं सौ सुमाय नम ओं कुं कुजाय नम ओं बुं बुधाय नम ओं गुं गुरव नम ओं शुं शुक्राय नम ओं शं शनाश्वराय नम ओं राम राहव नम ओं कें केतव नम ओ जपाकुसुम संकाशम काशपेय महाद्युति तमोरी सर्वपापा प्रणतस्मी दिवाक दधी शंख तुषाराभम क्षीरो दाणव संभव नमा शशिना सोम शंभोर्मकूषण धरणी गर्भ संभूत विद्युत्कंति सभम कुमार शक्तिहस्त तम मंगल प्राणमाह प्रियांगु काली का श्याम रूपेणा प्रतिमं बुधम सौम्यम सौम्य गुणोपेबुदम प्राणमाम्यहम दिवना चिषिना चुरु कंचन सन्नीभम उदिभूत त्रिलोकेश तम नमा बृहस्पति हिमकुंद मृणालभम दायत्या परम गुरु सर्वशास्त्र प्रवक्ता भार्गव प्राणमाम्यहम नीलांजन सभासम रविपुत्र यमाग्रज छायामर्तंड संभूत तम नमा शनाश्वर अर्धकाय महावीर चंद्रादीत विमर्दनम सिंहिका गर्भ संभूत तम राहम प्रणमाम्यहम पलाशपुष्पसंकाशम तारकाग्रहमस्तक रौद्रम रौद्रत्मकोरम तम के प्रणमाम्यहम ओं शांति 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 ओम मे योर माइंड्स बी प्रेजेंट बी open be graceful and blessed in this meeting today atast namaste so in the last session on march 11th we discussed about the scheme of different karmic periods and we saw that there are nine type of karmic periods but we did mainly a philosophical presentation and not so much a practical and i um asked for oh sorry i uh, because it's with the link there okay i asked for divya ji so that we could do a part 2 of this session where we can go for a more practical understanding uh doesn't matter if the person is born in any of uh, those ketu nakshatras in the case can be ashwini or magha or mola or whatever for the other um nine types we're not going to discuss this in a very detailed manner here because we are going to discuss in the course today we are going to have this slide and this slide are nine people that i took specifically it was not a very easy task to do but julia robert is going to be for the nakshatra of maga that we spoke the name in the previous session madonna purva pauguni shan connery utara pauguni and uh, so on we are um, taking nine um celebrity charts all of them are going to represent each nakshatra that we spoke the name in the previous session okay um this horoscopes and the information we have in the slides that are going to be receiving in the end of the session here it's the basic from where i took most of the information there is the chart if people want oh i need to correct this last one of our birthdays and here but in the one that i'm going to send to you um the links are there these symbols maybe you are already aware 
but here are the names of each one of the planets or the grahas. And there is Rahu and Ketu here as ascending node and descending node. And on the right, there is the, the roulette that is going and depends where we are starting. Here today, we are going to be starting with one um, that is going to be in Ketu, that is going to be um, Magha with Jordan Roberts, but we are going to see different types. And let me um, break here a little moment. The main point with this session here that we want to go beyond what we spoke in the previous session is like this. Each one of those shapes, each one of those types of karmic frames, they are going to design a different drama, a different novel, a different, um, different scope that just like when we understand Ayurveda that Vata, Pitta and Kappa metabolism are not the same. We can say that all the people that are born in Ketu Mahadasha, type one, as we are speaking, doesn't matter if it's born in Ashwin or it's born in Mag or it's born in Mula, they are going to have a similar, a similar trend of karmic unfolding. And in the course, of the 12 sessions that we're going to take, nine are going to be each one of them to understand, oh, even though I'm a Ashwini person, then the other person is Maga. We have the same type, we have the same mold of karmic unfolding. And this helps us to understand that if the person is born in Arahu Mahadasha, he is going to be a long-term karmic reaching to the fifth karmic period. If the person is born in, a, in the end of a, a Venus Mahadasha, we can reach the fifth karmic period that it's a very important point of time from 23 to up to 70. And this creates a huge, enormous impact on how our life is going to unfold in this life, okay? So this presentation here, it's mainly... Om Gurave Namah, 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 Om Gurave Namah,